Hello and welcome to Empty Pockets, the zero budget, zero knowledge snooker series. Here we are at the Crucible, the home of snooker, to watch a play about snooker. It's the opening night of the nap. And here we are, <laughs> Jenny Gaskell, Daniel James Gunson. Here we are to uh, interview some of the backstage staff to see how they're coping with all of the pressures of the opening night of this production. Please take it away, Jenny Gaskell. Thank you, Chris. Empty pockets! We're here to interview John. How are you, John? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm all, I'm all right, I'm all right, thank you. Where are we? We're at the Crucible Theatre in Sheffield. It's the home of snooker. What's going on, John? What's going on right now is we're presenting a show called The Nap, about snooker, about the World Championships, about Sheffield, with a stellar cast. And how are you coping? I'm pretty pumped right now. I'm pretty pumped. I'm focused. It's, it's, it's intense. Tonight's the night. Opening night. Big one. Big celebration, hopefully, afterwards. The press will love it. Yeah, I'm focused. Thanks, John. Empty pockets! Hello, Elaine. Hello. Here we are at the Crucible uh, to see the nap. I hear that you're um, a qualified snooker referee, is that true? No. I... All right. <laughs> no, no, go on. Uh, no, I'm not qualified. I like snooker a lot, so I looked into training to be a referee, All right. and I'm in the initial stages so, of doing that. So, uh, here's my question. How do, you, how do you play snooker? How do you play snooker? Well, if you're the referee, you must know. Well, there's a six-foot table. Two cues right. and a series of. Well, balls. you know your stuff. How much is a blue ball worth? Oh, now you're testing me. See, coming out with the big guns. <laughs> <laughs> what is it like? Six, five. Six is pink. Six is pink. What? It's five. What is? Blue ball. Is it? Yeah. Where is that on the table? <laughs> <laughs> It's, in the, it's the one in the middle. Fairly important, but not as important. The one, in the, the one that gets in the way all the time, the blue one. Empty pockets! Ra Ralph? Hello, Ralph? Hello, Ralph? Empty pockets! So here I am, the end of the show, with the stars of the show. We got Mark Addy. Ralph Little, and we got Jack O'Connell as well, going to talk to Ralph. Ralph, fantastic night. How did you find the show? A little lost for words there. Absolutely wonderful opening evening. Actually, looking a little bit off colour this evening. Uh, I'd say it all went well. What would you say to that? Yeah. Anyway, um, my friend Chris said you're in two pints of lager and a packet of crisps. Um, what would you say is your favourite continental lager? And there we have it, ladies and gents, the stars of The Nap here at the Crucible Theatre Sheffield through April 2nd. See you later. Empty pockets! Right, well, we've just come out from uh, The Nap. Very good, right? Really fantastic. Brilliant. Very good. Yes. Brilliant. We all really enjoyed that. <laughs> it was, it was like, it was my, two of my favourite things: theatre and snooker. It was like the two things were happening at the same time. At the same time, you had to like double think things. You were, they were playing actual games of snooker inside the theatre where they normally hold the real snooker, but it became real snooker. It was unbelievable. It was, it was phenomenal. There was bits where someone missed a shot. And we, we all went, ooh, ooh yeah, and then yeah, laughed yeah, yeah, yeah. because we, we realised we'd taken it so seriously. <laughs> we did. Still, uh, still know nothing about snooker, though. <laughs> what? Well, it you was, know. you know, red balls and stuff. But you know more than that, Daniel. Black Don't ball. Black seven. ball. Come yeah. on, can you give us another one? Um, blue, five. <laughs> blue, five. We've blue learned five. a lot. We've learned learned learned. Learned. I'd give it 21 balls out of 21, not including the cue ball. No, wait, why not include or the cue ball? Oh yeah, how many out of... 147! I'd give it 147 out of 147. I'd give it a really good, strong century break. Um, I'd Ooh, give it a few days so we can work out a proper rating system. <laughs> 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 we'll 
going to see over the next few weeks. Yeah, great. Fantastic. Really see you next fantastic. time. Thank you.